Welcome to Total War here, and today we're doing a Saving Your Disaster battle playing as uh, the Disciples of the Moor, defending against uh, the or the Great Orthodoxy, and we're defending a camp. So, the thing about defending camps is that there's only three uh, supply points, so you gain supplies very slowly, and you don't start off with any supplies at all. But luckily, the force that's coming at us isn't that strong, but still the guy's just having a bit of trouble. Anyway, let's jump in here and see if we can do something uh, to help this situation out. So, I've been testing out a little bit more about which uh, towers to use with ogres, and it seems to be the most cost-effective one. is not the Tier 3 tower, but actually the Tier 2 tower. Because uh, it's f what, 500, 500 cheaper. It doesn't do quite as much damage per shot, but it's more accurate and it shoots more often. So yeah, it seems like the cannon towers are the best way to go. But yeah, we don't start off with any uh, supplies to begin with. And we just have to choose the best position we can of the three. Which isn't necessarily the center position. All of them, I think, have two tower points. Yep. Ideally, we want to be as far away from them as possible to begin with, just so that we can slow them down. Can't build barricades at the start to funnel them in any which way direction. We've uh, got to use our noblars for that. At least he had a decent amount of garrison inside the, uh, the camp. But yeah, this is the position here that I'm going to hold. Because it's as far away from them as possible. It's fairly close to their reinforcements. We're essentially surrounded. But I think that, uh, what if we went out, like sallied out and fought them? Problem is, if we go out there and uh, charge at them here, right, we'll beat them. But then, by the time we've done that, they may have already gotten fairly close to this position here. So maybe I can leave some Noblars behind. Because uh, this is a pretty weak position here that they've chosen. Streltsies. Yeah, okay, not, not that big of a deal. Or what we could even do is wait for them to funnel into here and then pincer them. That actually might be better. Because it would be good to get rid of them sooner rather than later because I can't rely on towers here. Not yet anyway. So I'm going to rely on the ogres to punch this. Not going to use any noblars. Noblars are for holding power. If you want to dish out damage, you need ogres. So these guys here have all got guns, so they're not going to shoot over our heads. So three there, three here. Uh, that'll just have to do, I think. And uh, as soon as they start to come in through here, we charge at them. It would be better if we could let them come in a fair bit so they can really get squashed up. Because we don't want them to sh start shooting in here, and then all we're doing is... We, we don't, don't truly pincer them, we're going to pincer the whole lot of them, ideally. Alright. Alright, let's we'll see how that goes. So yeah, with the towers, we want to go with the tier 2 cannon tower. Yeah, they got the light war sleds. Those are... Those are pretty dangerous, but we'll see. Maybe they'll use them badly. They're they're not so good inside of settlements. They're a bit derpy, so we'll see if that works for us. We got a lot of ammunition, but they need time to shoot it all off. Them coming around over here is not ideal. Bring us me. Yeah, we're gaining supplies really slowly. But it's really important not to go with the tier 1 towers, because tier 1 towers suck. Me, me, me. No point ch oh, I really was hoping they wouldn't do this. No point going after them. We've got to wait for this moment. Just wait for it. The They're not doing that much damage to us, so it's not that big of a deal. Okay. Me, me. Yeah, see, this is what I didn't want them to be doing. I wanted them to come in a little bit more. But at least they are partially obstructed there. 
Still don't have a single tower ready to go. Okay, well the armored Cossars are going down pretty quick there. Try to use the mass of the Ogres to push through the first load to at least get them all into melee so they're not shooting. It's working out pretty well so far. They haven't uh, capped any points, that's good. These guys are going around fairly slowly. Those Streltsies, okay good, we can kind of deal with them. Okay. These ones coming into melee here, they're not good against Ogres. And their reinforcements have arrived. Where's me master? But at least while they're in melee, they're not shooting, so that's something. General's going down, that's good. Okay, here we go. I'm a little bit late on that, but uh, better late than never. Let's get to it. Would be good to have an ogre unit come around over here and cut off their escape. But the pathfinding is not amazing. I'm not even sure we're going to make it there. Where are you? Come on, you need to kill this dude. God, they're still fighting. Alright, with these Kossars coming, sorry, uh, Streltsies coming in here, let's wait until they get to about this point before we swing around. We don't give them a chance to shoot at us. They are shooting at us. Uh, okay, that's bad, that's bad, that's bad. Get back, get back. Don't go over there, we've got to protect this point. Uh, we really need ogres over here to be dealing with the light war sleds, but I don't have any. Unfortunately, Noblars are not good at dealing with, uh, with light war sleds because they're anti-infantry. Luckily, they didn't really charge in, which is really their strong point. And if we could shoot at the okay, good. The towers are active now. That's great. Okay, I need some guys back over here. This is uh, pretty urgent now. Although, yeah, look, we only need one of them to stay there. Keep running them down. Bit obstructed. Okay, try to get over there. I think they're just trying to slow us down there, which is a bit silly. Uh, that's actually not doing too well for them there. In the tribe. Rampage this way. Come on, over here, over here. Okay, well, at least the light war sleds aren't really doing a great job there. That's good. We're definitely not going to beat the Streltsies in melee, but at least they're kind of falling back a bit. Could you shoot into the... Could you shoot into the Streltsy there, please? If we can try to get them to blob up as much as possible, that'd be great. Just keep them out of this position here, please. Oh, no, 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 don't shoot, my lord. Jeez, they gave our ogres here a hard time. Okay, we've got another tower position ready to start shooting. It'll take a little while, but just have the Noblars hold them back as long as possible. Yeah. The position here is actually pretty good because it's all just guns. So they're going to have a hard time shooting at the Noblars over their own troops' heads. Okay, go around this way, go around this way. Me. Me. 
Damn these light wall slates gave me a hard time. Right, I need you to be shooting into this group here. Yeah, see, they're all obstructed. Good. The Noblars are just pretty good at just holding the line. That's what we need them to do. Okay, maybe just keep the Yogas out of this for a little bit. Oh, that's useless. Oh god, they just can't deal with this crap at all. Well, now we have to rely very heavily on the Noblars, because I don't really have uh, any Ogres left. I don't have many Ogres left in the market. Oh, they got a couple of Streltsers came back. Okay, might be a good idea to recap this position. Uh, hold this position over here, it's kind of more important. This guy's killed 22 ogres, but he doesn't have that much damage, he just killed a lot of them. So they were already damaged prior. Okay, maybe maybe get rid of this. It, it would be good to kill him, but well, at least we weren't in a big blob there. See, if I manage to capture this point here, at least if we end up losing this position, the battle shouldn't be over. Yeah, that dude there. Our guys are just not doing a good job against him. So let's bring you around over here, start recapping this. Because the Noblars are actually doing a really good job here. Really good job. And the towers are doing their job as well. Balance of powers kind of improving. Still not in our favor, but it's improving. Yeah, try to stay away from him. He's just killing too many ogres. Maybe, maybe this guy should go over there and finish the job. I should have left him there. But then again, if I had left him there, I wouldn't have been able to recap this point. Yeah, you come over here. Okay, we've got some more... Hang on, hang on. This one here might actually be more important to kill. Although she's just going to recap this position. Yeah, the Noblars are kind of doing better than the uh, than the Ogres did. At least at holding the line. Hey, watch out, we're getting to get dropped here. Bounce of power's looking good. But they're starting to overrun us a little bit here. Okay, he's killing her off real quick. That's good. And we've almost recaptured all the points. Yes. Not high leadership at all. Okay, she's almost gotten the number of spells from out of her. Bounce power's looking good. Because the towers are doing their job. Just keep them out of the bloody town square. They're just sending a couple... Those guys there will take ages to... Uh, cap the town square. They actually pulled through our line a little bit. That's okay. If we lose this position here now, it's not the end of the world. I think we just inflicted the army losses on them. Did we? Yeah, we did. We did, we did. We got them. Definitely wasn't a clean victory, but we were up against the odds here. We killed her off. And now just try to run down as many of them as possible. Come over here, kill him. Alright, cool. Try to kill off as many of them as possible. 
Um, I think some units did get wiped out, mainly some of the Ogre Bulls. But they should be able to be re-recruited just directly at the camp. So yeah, let's kill him so he doesn't end up riding a bear next time that we see him. But yeah, definitely would have been better if I had left him here, uh, there to finish him off at the start. That would have been pretty good, because he was a major nuisance. So I definitely wasn't fought perfectly, but we got through it. Obviously, I don't need to use the supplies now. So, oh, it actually doesn't look like any units got wiped out. We'll have a look and see how the, the campaign is going. But yeah, using... The, well, they brought nothing but guns, right? They should have brought some archer units because they just weren't over, able to fire over each other's heads. But yeah, just using the layout of the camp, for the most part, we were able to minimize the amount of damage they were dishing out. Yeah, those light sleds were a big problem, even though going up against large units, they're just really good. And we completely wiped out all their forces. Dead to the last one. Uh, your money seems fine. I think it would be good if you replenish, just in case they're coming back anytime soon. <laughs> That's what happens when you put a camp in their land. You, you allied with the Bjornlings, okay. Campaign seems to be going pretty well, though. Just that one camp was in danger. So that was the Middenland camp, it must be over here. Is, is that the one? Yeah, and, and you were already recruiting some dual weapons. You could tell it was these two because they weren't in the battle and they're at full strength. But you didn't get any further replenishment. My gut is law. So, at least you can bring this guy in to reinforce that position now. What you can potentially do is transfer healthy units into this one, specifically the Noblars, right? They're actually really good at holding those positions. Um, and maybe even um, some scrap launchers. Yeah, just transfer them into here and take out all of the damaged units because within the, the radius of the camp, these guys here are immune to all attrition and get loads of replenishment. Of course, if you go over here to fix up the camp, you're not going to be able to capture Delbers this turn. But that's not that important at all. You need to protect your camp because you've invested a fair bit into this. Yeah. But other than that, the campaign seems to be going just fine. Anyway, that's the end of this one here, guys. Hope you enjoyed it. Hope you learned something. Appreciate you. And we'll see you next time, fuckers. Bye.